Hey YouTubers, it's Dr. Piddles again. Uh, last time I talked about uh, Avid Scorch, and this time I want to talk about a new app called Mimi Copy, um, which I use in the music classroom. Mimi Copy kind of fills in the gaps that Avid Scorch leaves behind. Uh, so this is what it looks like. You can go to here, File. You can import songs from um, your the iPod, which is just the iPad itself. So the songs that are saved on here in your iTunes library. Um, you can actually do a Wi-Fi thing, which is kind of cool, where it sets up a little Wi-Fi, wi and as long as you're connected to the same network um, on your computer, you can send files over from your computer that you don't have on your iPad to use in this program, which is cool. Uh, let me show you how it works. So it loads up. Um, it obviously plays. You can change the pitch by half step, so change the key. And then I like it because all you have to do is hit, and it goes back to the original key. Change the tempo. Speed it up, slow it down. Again, just hit the button, it goes back to normal. You can loop a section. If you want to work on a particular section, um, just kind of skip around with this, these buttons down here. Very nice. So it's just a very cool app um, to use with any MP3 file that you have. Whether you need to practice slower, if it, you can't get practice with the practice track, it's, if it's like too fast or something, you can slow it down and practice with it then. Um, or if it's too high or too low, you can slow, uh, you can raise or lower the key of the practice track by half steps. So very useful. And that's, again, it's called Mimi Copy, M-I-M-I -I Copy.